This is a really easy and fun way to get started into the wonderful world of Santastic products, specifically clay. Today, you're going to be making a modern fossil bowl designed by Marisa Puelco. First, gather up everything you're going to need for your project. That way, you're not halfway through and running through the house with dirty hands. Second, grab your baby powder. You're going to sprinkle the powder over your work area. The baby powder will make sure that your clay doesn't stick. Then, take your rolling pin, roll out an even slab of fantastic modeling clay. You're aiming for about a half an inch thick. Then dust the inside of a plastic bowl with more baby powder. You'll be using this bowl as a mold. Carefully drape your clay over it. Gently smooth out any wrinkles with your fingers. If you need to, you can always use more clay to help you patch up any holes or rips. There are also clay modeling tools you can use. Or if you slightly dampen your fingers, it will also help you smooth out any wrinkles. At this point, press the slab firmly into the bowl using your clay modeling tool. Trim off any excess clay and smooth out the edges. Grab your baby powder again and dust the inside of the bowl. The powder will make sure that the trinkets you're using don't stick to the clay when you're making impressions. Speaking of which, take your trinkets and make impressions to the inside of the bowl. Make sure though, when you're pressing, you're not pressing them too far in. You're looking for about no more than halfway into the clay. Keep pressing in various objects until you're happy with the impressions. You can use your modeling tools as well to define or touch up any of the shapes. Wet your fingers again and smooth over any cracks in the bowl. At this point, you're going to be stepping away and leaving your bowl for a while to make sure it's completely dry. You'll notice when you come back to your bowl that it shrunk slightly. That's totally normal. You'll know the bowl is dry when it pops away from the mold and it's no longer cool to the touch. When the clay is dry, remove it from the molding bowl. You can file the edges smooth with an emery board, a nail file. Now you've got a bowl, a decorative fossil bowl to be exact. You can leave it au naturel, or you can decorate it, paint it any way you'd like.